Every day we see incredible stories being told by our customers, but occasionally we see one that truly defines what Heritage Makers is all about. And this is one of those stories. So for 2009, I'm very pleased to award the Best of Heritage Past to Gloria Leoncia Falcón Salazé Molise for her book, Beyond the Pier. Gloria recounts the stories of her upbringing in, in poverty in the Philippines and makes special note of how thankful she is for her parents who sacrificed everything so that Gloria could attend school. As a young woman, she met a serviceman serving in, in, in the Philippines during World War II. He brought her to Iowa with a new child and one on the way. And then something tragic happened. George left, and Gloria was alone. After Gloria's husband abandoned her and her two young children, we see the grace of God evident in the kindness of strangers. Her former in-laws offered their support, standing up for their grandchildren in their hour of need, and helping Gloria get back on her feet. In fact, Gloria's entire newfound hometown in Iowa rallied around her, making her a part of the community despite her language and cultural barriers. Gloria's story is a quintessential story of America. An immigrant moves to a small Midwestern town, builds a life from hard work and perseverance, raises a family, enjoys a successful career, weaves her life into the fabric of her community. And as she nears the end of her life, she is grateful for every moment and for God's hand in directing all of it. Plentiful reason for all of us to be inspired, thanks to the magic of storytelling and the products and consultants of Heritage Makers. I want to read a few lines from the conclusion of her storybook. While my life storybook comes to a close, my life sure doesn't. As my 84th birthday gets closer, I keep telling Archie, that's why we're still alive. We still have work to do. I look forward to working to help my family for many years to come and forever after this book can become a keepsake of all the stories I've shared and all the ones you've never heard before. I find it rather fitting that my maiden name Salazé means to tell a story in the Philippines. I hope this book has given you a glimpse into what has made me who I am today. May you see that my experiences were not often easy but keeping a smile on my face and a bounce in my step made a big difference in getting me through the tough spots. I made it beyond the pier, beyond the bank, and beyond the farm. These three places in my life helped shape who I've become today, and through it all, God has been there with me every step of the way. So congratulations to Gloria Molise for her inspiring life story, Beyond the Pier. There's no question this will inspire many people in her family, in her town, and throughout the Heritage Makers community. Thanks, Gloria, for sharing this great story with all of us.